Hi, this is Kate from Isalicious Designs again. We're going to do another tutorial on another stitch for our Lumigurumi, and this time we're going to do the back post. And we're going to show you, I'm going to show you how to work in the back post. So, this is my last stitch for my round. I will do a single crochet and move my stitch marker. and we will work in the back post. Now, for the front post, we came in through the front and out through the back for the, the next stitch. It's the opposite way. This time we come in through the back like that. So this is how we, this is our first stitch, this is our second stitch. So we come in through the back of our second stitch and come out through the front of our third stitch and there's the little post that you can see the little link between the two stitches which they're calling a post and you pull your band through and do a single crochet well we're doing a single crochet in this in this instance and again push through pull your band back so this way we're working in the back post it draws it kind of draws things in and makes things a little bit uh, as you can see it's sort of making things a little bit narrow but it's also coming out at an angle do you see that which is quite important. So if you're doing this for like a hat, again, this is another way that you could do the brim of a hat or the peak of a cap by working the back post. It's just another stitch to add to the arsenal of stitches that you're going to have here. I'm sure that we're not going to be able to convert all of them. I mean, some of them are so intricate, but it would be nice to have a few that we can use. Especially when we're trying to follow crochet patterns and they might ask for something like this. In a crochet pattern, the abbreviation for this would be um, a BP back post obviously so I'm making my way around going through the back and out the other side So instead of working those inside stitches, the top stitches here, but it's all about it's all about creating shapes, isn't it? This this lumigurumi and armigurumi, it's all about you know putting different shapes together to form something, and uh, this just. does that in a new way. Carefully getting there. So I'll show you what this looks like when we're done. Just working this back post and back to the beginning. I'm going to just do a single crochet Gosh, if I can get my stitch marker out of the way. <laughs> I'll do a single crochet in red and move my stitch marker. So this is how it would look. So it's sort of brought it in a little bit, as you can see. So that'd be quite good um, because then our next round it would come out again. 
So for a neck or something like that, you could you know, draw in a neck and then come out again. I'm not sure if you can really see that. But anyway, that is working in the back post. There you go.